literally every single day is something new in regards to Lamar Jackson, the contract negotiations, and the Ravens. It's something new every single day without fail, and it has been this way for a very, very long time. And yesterday, yesterday was no different. Team Keep It Clean. What's going on? It's Graven here with another video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Subscribe and turn your notifications on because I don't want you missing out because it's a lot of videos. I'm sure we're going to revisit this whole Ken Francis thing once again because I'm sure this will not be the last time we hear of the name Ken Francis. But who is Ken Francis? What is a Ken Francis? Where did Ken Francis come from? Well, Ken Francis is Lamar Jackson's business partner um, who uh, really Mike Florio. Mike Florio, uh, he made sure that like the NFL world knew who Ken Francis was but before yesterday. Because if I take you back, remember that article that came out a couple days ago? Mike Florio on ProFootballTalk.com. Mike Florio, he let it be known like, hey, there's somebody who's not certified by the NFLPA that's trying to negotiate on Lamar's behalf, trying to talk to teams on Lamar's behalf. And that was the article where he said that, hey, Lamar is ready to move on from the Ravens. He said that that's what uh, Lamar's representation said, allegedly. Um, he also talked about how um, the guy's been contacting teams and whatnot, just trying to get something stirred up as far as Lamar Jackson, because apparently uh, things have been dry. So Anyway, something that he did at the end of that article, it stuck out to me. And I was like, huh, okay, I, I see. And I guess it worked. Because at the very end of the article, the very last two sentences, this is what they said. Uh, Mike Florio, he said, we're told that the NFLPA is aware of the situation. It's unclear whether the league was. It now is, if anyone at 345 Park Avenue, and he put in parentheses, hello, is reading these words. So basically, he said, hey, I'm trying to snitch. I'm using my article and I'm snitching. I'm telling you what it is. And I, I guess now uh, he can celebrate since the league obviously knows what's going on based off of all the, the memo that they sent out yesterday. Uh, and let's just read that memo word for word. It says, uh, to chief executives, presidents, general managers, and club contract negotiators from NFL Management Council uh, regarding uncertified representation, Ken Francis. And this reads verbatim. The NFLPA has informed us that a person by the name of Ken Francis, who is not, and they put, they underline the word not, who is not an NFLPA certified agent, may be contacting clubs and attempting to persuade club personnel to enter into negotiations with or concerning Lamar Jackson, who is currently under a non-exclusive franchise tender with the Baltimore Ravens. As an uncertified person, Mr. Francis is prohibited from negotiating offer sheets or player contracts or discussing potential trades on behalf of any, they underline the word any, NFL player or prospective player or assisting in or advising with respect to such negotiations. So basically that's saying he can't be part of negotiations. Like he, he Lamar being his own agent, the, the guy, he can advise Lamar, but he can't be part of the negotiations, even as a represent as a representative of anything. No, he can't be part of that. But anyway, uh, it says clubs are reminded that under Article 48 of the NFL Collective Bargaining Agreement, an offer sheet which may result in an NFL player contract may only be negotiated with the player if he is acting on his own behalf or with the player's NFLPA certified agent. To be clear, Mr. Jackson is not currently represented represented by an NFLPA certified agent. Violation of this rule may result in disapproval of any offer sheet or resulting player contract entered into by Mr. Jackson and the new club. So basically saying like, hey, if if you wanna you wanna negotiate with this guy, Ken Francis, if if y'all end up signing Lamar to an offer sheet and it's through him, uh nah, we ain't putting that through. So boy, this oof, this thing done took another turn. It keeps taking all these different turns. It's like nonstop. And it said, uh, for additional information, please see MC to uh, that that's not important. But anyway, um, that's the memo that they sent out. And it's like, man, like, what's gonna happen next? But Lamar says, stop lying. That man never tried to negotiate for me. So Lamar said, hey, that, that's, that's not true. And he was quote tweeting uh, Tom Pelissero uh, when Tom Pelissero said that uh, Kenny Francis uh, is a Florida man. What, like, what, why you gotta say that? You ain't gotta say that. Cause you, when people say a Florida man, that makes somebody sound crazy. Cause you, we, I know y'all all heard the term Florida man before. Whenever you hear that, it's about somebody that did something crazy down here in Florida. But anyway, uh, Tom Pelissero said, Ken Francis is a Florida man who most recently, he could have said a man from Florida or is from Florida, from South Florida. Something. But anyway, 
Ken, Ken Francis is a Florida man who most recently was pitching a home fitness invention, I'm told. He is now trying to negotiate a nine-figure contract with NFL teams who are being told they're not allowed to negotiate with him because he's not a certified agent. So, Tom Pelissero let him be known that, hey, he, he's out here trying to negotiate. And he ain't even say allegedly. He said, no, he's trying to negotiate. Um, so, and, and since he's not certified by the NFLPA, he can't do it. I would hope that that wasn't true. Um, because even if Lamar has his own representation, you got to get it cleared. You, you got to get it cleared by the NFLPA. Um, even if it's not an agent or whatnot, it, it got to be clear. So you want to make sure that you do this thing the right way. So hopefully that's not true. I know a lot of people are like, oh, since the, the, the league sent out this memo, then it's got to be true. Since they sent it to all 32 teams and whatnot, the presidents, the GMs, all that, it's got to be true. So hey, that's again, it's one of those things that <laughs> we won't know. Again, the same thing. We don't know. We won't know. It's so much that we don't know. So much comes out. A lot of reports and stuff come out, but it's a lot that we just do not know. This thing is crazy, man. But Lamar, being the uh, opportunistic person he is, he was like, you know what? Watch this. All this stuff coming out about Kim Francis. All these reports and him saying, oh, that's not true. He... he <laughs> Capitalizing on this he, he said let me make the most of this moment And he tweeted out He said my business partner Ken and I Will be dropping the uh, entire gym This summer Hashtag stay tuned Hashtag trust And this was a, uh, a, a Like sort of a, a portable gym Cause it comes I don't think it comes with that little the, the iPad I don't think it comes with the iPad Or the tablet that was in the video But it's a portable gym That has weights on there It has a mat on there um, And I guess you, you're gonna be able to take it wherever, With you wherever you go uh, so Lamar was like, you know, I'm, I'm going to capitalize on this opportunity. I'm, I'm going to take this opportunity and promote it. Because what, what's the saying? Uh, even bad pu publicity is good publicity. Or there's no such thing as bad publicity because I, I forgot what the saying is. Y'all would know it. But anyway, Lamar said, I'm, I'm going to make the most of this opportunity right here, right now. But I like I, I, don't, I don't even know what to say about this whole thing. This thing crazy, man. It's crazy, but it. It is what it is. So, um, what's next? What's next? I, I I really couldn't tell you. But this whole thing is just, I don't know where this puts Lamar with the Ravens. I, I, I just really don't know. We, we really don't know. Um, so much is, is just up in the air right now. And I don't even know what to think about it. But... That's that. So it, it, this is like <laughs> it's crazy, man. It's and again, it's always something new every single day. It is every single day. Todos los días. Every, every single day is something new. Um. So I guess until whatever new thing comes out next, we out.